So check it out. Two teenagers now suspended from school accused of gunning for trouble. Well, those students will tell you they don't understand why it's a big deal because they're not real guns. But the school is sticking to its guns and punishing them. Seven's Kelly O'Hara spoke with the students. She's live in Taunton now with the story for us. Kelly? That's right. These teens say they meant no harm and all they want to do is go back to school. Two taunting teens in trouble for taking this picture. And suspend us over one photo. It's a little too far. The 16-year-olds say they were headed to homecoming, and instead of Tito Velez giving his girlfriend Jamie flowers, they posed for this photo with their airsoft guns and posted it on Facebook with the caption, Homecoming 2014. And I guess the school took that as a threat but we didn't mean it in a threatening way. And the school suspended them both. They're juniors in high school. They know it's provocative and they, uh, and, and they know or should know better uh, that things like that scare other students. Tito and Jamie say they're now forced to stay home for 10 days and they think the school overreacted. They say the guns aren't even real and the photo was taken in their living room. We said that it wasn't, it's not like it happened at school. We had the guns here and then that's where the pictures were taken and they said it didn't matter. I mean, it was just a photo. It's not in the rule book. There's nothing against photos on a personal profile. But the school superintendent is sticking to his guns over the suspension. Well, it's not a social media uh, thing. It's not a gun thing. You know, it, what it is is the students engaging in activity. Now, these teens say that they haven't received their formal suspension letters in the mail, so they don't exactly know if it's just a suspension or something else. But again, they say tonight they meant no harm. Reporting live in Taunton this evening, Kelly O'Hara, 7 News.